Hi, I'm Dr. H from Magic Experiments, where science should be available to everyone. Today I have with me Stephanie, my assistant, and she's going to help us show today's uh, experiment called Magic Germ. Okay? You've probably seen our other experiment called Magic Glow in the Dark Solution, and this is a take of that one. Okay? So, how many times at home do you wonder, do your kids really wash their hands or not? Steph, how many times do I ask you, have you washed your hands? A bunch. A bunch. And she always tells me she washes her hands, but I never know. But with this experiment, if you're interested, check us out. You'll actually see if she really did. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some cream, okay? And all I did is I put some, uh, some solution, uh, tonic solution, into some cream, okay? And a little, other, little secret recipe that I have. And I'm going to ask her to rub it in her hands and get it rubbed in really good, okay? And then I have an ordinary black light, okay? This black light, we're going to talk about it in a little while. So, Steph, just shut the lights off and let's see what happens, okay? So, here's the black light, okay? And I'm going to put it on her hands, okay? And then look what you can see, all right? You can see where she put the lotion and rubbed in her hands. You can actually see it glowing in the dark. Okay? Now, if I turn her hand around on the other side, you can actually see when she rubbed her hands in. If you look, if she opens her fingers up a little bit, I can see in between her fingers, up by her nails, all over, I can see if she really did wash her hands. So, go ahead, Steph, go wash your hands while I explain. So, where, what is this black light used for? So, in nature, actually, if you have a snake or a reptile, you can get these in hardware stores. The light serves as a heat source for the reptiles to actually absorb it, absorb this energy in the form of heat. Actually, the police department uses this all the time. What I've done is I sprinkled a little bit of a little bit of the chemical on the table, and you probably see in solution uh, on the TV they pass a light over, and you can actually see where somebody's fingerprints, or in this case, where a chemical has been that glows in the dark. So if you see it, the light is actually shining on it. And the chemical absorbs that energy just like the reptile, but in this case, it releases it as light. Okay? So, once Steph comes back, I'm going to take this light, pass it over her hands, and usually the kids don't get their hands washed the first time. The lotion is a little bit sticky. So, let's see. So, here's Steph. I'm going to take it over her hands. She's done a much better job, as, as, if you can see. But actually, if you look right here, on the, in the palm of her hand, she didn't get right there, okay? So it's actually, she didn't wash her hands fully, but she did a good job up at the top. If we go on her other side of her hand, you can see she's removed almost everything on the other side of her hand. She's done a great job. So if you're really interested in this experiment, you want to learn more about it, check us out at magicexperiments.com.